Hello beautiful and welcome back. Uh, today I have another wig review for you and today I am going to be showing you the On Point wig by Raquel Welch. The color of this wig is copper mahogany and it is absolutely gorgeous. So before we get too far into it, let me do a 360 spin for you so you can see what she looks like on all sides. Okay, so On Point is my absolute favorite kind of bob. It is a longer in the front, shorter in the back, more of an angled bob, and I absolutely adore it. Um, the, the things that really make this wig a little special for me is a couple things. One, the cut that I already told you about. Uh, it's very, very flattering haircut. It's fantastic. Um, also the fact that it's shorter in the back, it's not going to rub like crazy on your nape. It's not gonna get a lot of tangles. It's not gonna get matted as much. Um, it's going to actually preserve the life of the wig. Um, the Lace Front by Raquel Welch is phenomenal. I love their lace fronts. They are some of the best, even with the darker colors, they just seem to melt very well into your skin. And even with just a little bit of powder, you can make those knots disappear. Uh, the other thing about this wig that I do enjoy is the fact that it's not falling in my face. It's definitely framing my face very well. Even putting my head down, a couple of strands fall, but for the most part, this is staying open, which is fantastic for going out to restaurants and eating. Um, and I think a lot of that has to do with the fact that this has a center part. This is not a part that you can freely change. It does not have a um, full monofilament top. It just has this hand-tied monofilament uh, top right here in the middle. And you can part it anywhere right about in between where my fingertips are. Uh, not a lot of parting space at all. But if you like a center part, then there's no need to change it whatsoever, which is great. Um, I do enjoy center parts, side parts, whatever. Um, so that doesn't bother me at all. And I really do think it helps to keep it in that, that shape so that, you know, it's not falling in your face all the time. Um, the other really cool thing about it is the memory cap on the inside, which is like a silicone material that is on the actual wefts. And I'll take it off and show it to you. All right, before I show you the inside, I do you wanna quickly talk about this color? Uh, this is copper mahogany, and as the name suggests, mahogany is that uh, medium to darkish brown that you see there. And then the copper is obviously these auburn coppery highlights. They are gorgeous. Um, they are done very well to the point where, you know, you've know you got some bigger chunks and then some lighter, uh, more evenly spaced highlights. It's just really, really pretty. So there is your parting space. Not a ton, um, not a ton at all, uh, but you know, it does have uh, that, that, that permatease on either side, lays on top of the permatease, nice lot of volume there, uh, and that gorgeous lace front. Here are your felt covered ear tabs and your extended nape, which is also felt covered. Even holding it up, you can even see that it's kind of trying to part there in the middle. That is very helpful for not falling in your face. Uh, the other thing I wanted to show it to you, and hopefully it shows up on my camera pretty well. See how shiny the wefts are? That is that memory cap. That is the uh, silicone, I think it's silicone, not entirely sure, uh, lining that uh, is very helpful for gripping. It does a great job hanging on to my wig grip here, as well as if you have no hair whatsoever, it will really cling to your skin really well and help the wig from moving around. While I'm putting this on, one thing I will say that I'm probably going to alter on this wig is the parting space. Because the parting space is so uh, dense, it doesn't have much of a part. So um, I'll have another video on that. I will show you guys how I get around that. Uh, so stay tuned. Uh, but you know, you could do some minor 
plucking uh, if you wanted to kind of open that up a little bit. But if you do plucking, please make sure that you go very slow. You take one strand at a time. Um, you cannot put this hair back. Um, well, unless you're a wig maker. Um, I can't put this wig, this hair back. So just go very, very slow if you do any plucking. Um, but honestly, if you guys know the scar away trick, that would probably work, some concealer. Um, and like I said, I'll have another video on that for you. All right, so let's give you guys some measurements here. Uh, I have a seven inch face from my hairline to the tip of my chin. And the measurements on here is a front of 10.5 inches, the crown of 12 inches, uh, sides of 10.5, and a back of eight inches while the nape is four inches. And the wig weighs in right at about five ounces. Okay, so if you want to pick up the On Point wig by Raquel Welch, make sure you head on over to wigstudio1.com and type in On Point. Uh, you can also use the coupon code BEAUTIFULYOU and you'll get 30% off of your purchase. Uh, you also can head on over to the Wig Studio One uh, Facebook page. There you'll find myself and all the employees of Wig Studio One. It is called uh, Wig Studio One Wig and Topper Support Group. We also have about 7,000 and counting members that it will be there to help you support you through your hair loss journey. Also, if you're still here, please make sure to hit that subscribe button. Um, there's also that bell icon. So if you want to be notified every time that I post, you can hit that and that will make sure to let you know. All right, as always, thank you so much for hanging out with me today. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye, beautiful.